that right? Seems about right. <laughs> You're out of breath from that. Yeah, do people who live in Colorado, like, are they always out of breath or do they get used to it? They get used to it. Because <laughs> when we go up the mountains, we can't fucking breathe. Do people who live in the mountains come down to sea level and hyperventilate? No, they just can run really fast and really far. Yeah. I brought my workout clothes. Thinking I was like gonna do a whole. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm like, oh, I just pulled a log on the fire. We are going outside. We came all the way up to the mountain and all you wanna do is stay inside. That's all we do anyway. We are going to you see nature. You said an adventure. We drove from one house to another house. What more do you want? To see what's outside. Look at it. <laughs> Take a look. Exactly, I wanna be out there. Okay, I know you're not asleep. Why don't you, uh... Just finished. 10 out of 10. 10? 10 out of 10, read it cover to cover, even the acknowledgements. Give us your, uh, <laughs> book review. Um, this was a really funny, really relatable book by a really, really funny and relatable woman, Samantha Irby. <laughs> I'm gonna read her first book, Needy, because she referenced it a lot in there, and I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. What'd you like about it? All the things I just said. What are you, the New York Times? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's a really cozy image we got going here. Why don't you give us a little tour? Um, okay, so Ted and I, I haven't left the house since last March. So, um, you know, naturally Ted's been like, can we go somewhere? And our options are very limited in a pandemic, but we're lucky enough to be two hours away from the mountains. Um, and I've been really wanting some like cold weather, some snow. So <clears throat> we rented um, a cabin in Big Bear and we just drove up last night or just two nights, and here we are. And this is the cabin. It's a little cozy little cabin. We've got our fireplace. We've got... Um, this couch is the most uncomfortable thing I've ever sat in. Can you guys, like, see how uncomfortable it is? Like, Um, More of a bed than a couch. The only comfortable furniture in this whole house is that chair. Actually, I love it here. I just, there are certain things. So like, none of the furniture is comfy. Which is kind of a big thing. And then, um... Okay, take five. Now that you've climbed the stairs. <laughs> I truly want to test my... Okay, so my resting heart rate is like 67. Let's see what it is right now. Just literally climbing some stairs. It's the altitude, I'll get you. 112! Double! <laughs> that, is, that is what my heart rate is when I'm doing one of my dance workouts. <laughs> Guys, if you wanna get in shape, literally drive 7,000 miles. Feet. <laughs> <laughs> drive 7,000 feet. Above sea level, <laughs> and just simply <laughs> move around. But um, it only works like the first day or two because then you get used to it. Um, and then this is our bed, which is also very uncomfortable. But not only that, they said it was a queen, and it's clearly a full. It's definitely a full sleeping with you because you sleep like that. That's how she sleeps. But I like it. I just like, I don't know. I have like anxiety from being away from home and when I have anxiety it just makes me feel better to like complain and bitch about everything around me. I'm not ungrateful. Like I'm truly like 
this is so nice. I wish this was my cabin, but then I also want to be like, they didn't refill the ice cube trays for us. And there's another bedroom in here, which we're not really using. Oh wait, this painting. Okay, there's a painting. <laughs> Look how good that wolf looks. I want to start your own vlog. There's snow, show them the snow. Yay. It'd be nice to go out there, I think. No, it's so cold. So cold. So cold. Careful. We're gonna work it's out. It's a lot easier going down. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is my favorite part. Hey, little guy. You're sitting there pooping, you're like, where's the toilet paper? And he's like, <laughs> Very like 80s, 90s kitchen. Kind of reminds me of the kitchen I grew up in. Not totally, but like the cabinetry, very much so. And we also have one of these lazy Susans in the corner. <laughs> Breathing again. Um, and uh, I didn't really see it. Oh, we had one of these lazy Susans growing up. And so this was like a blast from the past. Um, and then that's it. And then there's a deck here. But look at these. Anybody who doesn't live in like the desert is like totally like, why are you excited? But I'm like, you guys, <laughs> have you ever in your life? We should take some of these home and put peanut butter and bird seed on them. We literally just threw a bunch away. Well, those were the ones we bought at, we home. bought those at Vaughn's. They're home scented. Depot's. Those... Home Depot's. <laughs> <laughs> we literally, yeah, I just threw a bag of... You know those like scented pine cones you can get like from the grocery store? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just threw those away, but now I'm like, in nature, this is a different story. Like these aren't scented, these are like the real deal. You're gonna hurt yourself. Okay. Oh, actually, oh, never mind. That was actually really bad. That was actually bad because I want to keep this. Okay, the people who own this place don't seem like Trump supporters. Like there's like crystals and there's like, like I think they live in Silver Lake. But there's a huge American flag in the front. So I'm like... <laughs> that. Hi. I don't have any food, but... Over here! This is pretty. I decided uh, that we should get out of the house. I decided. <laughs> I had to force you to come here. No. This is the best one I found. Alright, let's see. These are okay. I'm gonna start with this guy just to get my hands Oh, you kept up. my pebble? Yeah. Look at this pebble I found. It's like a classic pebble. It's like... <laughs> can't, they don't make them like this anymore. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> Alright, let's see. You're doing all- oh, I thought you were throwing them all in there! Okay! That one kind of flopped. Oh, this is the best one. Alright, let's see, let's see. Oh! Two. Two, but it was the high two. It's high two. <laughs> Alright, let's go for- three. Okay, I hope the camera's picking this up. Was that a one? Oh I'm no. Like <laughs> Just so you know, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> gonna try it with my classic guy. <laughs> okay. Did it made that a good it made a good sound. I mean that was I thought that's what we were doing. Let's do an instant replay of the sound. <laughs> Boom. It, a classic pebble made a classic sound. Okay, that is, that's true. Mm -hmm. I don't think I can whip it that hard. All right, you don't need to whip it hard. Alright, don't tell me what okay. to do. Okay, oh, wow. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, they're partners. Are we taking a duck break? They're partners. I know. Hey. How long have you guys been married? Are you making small talks with a duck? Do you guys have any kids? Okay, this one's gonna be the one. Just kidding. Oh! That was three! 
I missed it. That's not my fault. Yes, that was it is. Three. You were standing in the way of it. Because it went over here. Well, why are you throwing I it over there? Where it goes. <laughs> Don't miss this. This is gonna be a good one. I didn't even see it. Went over there. You idiot. Okay, my turn. Hello, duckies. Come here. I don't have food, but I'll pet you. I'll pet you. It'll feel good. Come here. I just want to hold a duck. Any takers? How about you? Come here. They're all like talking to each other, being like, go, get away from her. I can tell. Come here. I will literally let you bite my hand. I don't care. Like, I just want to touch you. Come here. Come here. Oh, you're so close. You're so close. I won't hurt you, I promise. What is that? Like a pelican or like, like a pelican or a stork or something. What's the difference between a pelican and a stork? One delivers babies and the other doesn't. Why is that word sounding so wrong to me? Stork. Hi, how about a little nap? They know you got nothing to offer. I know. They're wise. Nothing to love, baby. Hey, I feel like they like kind of want me to pet them. I think you're pro kind of the vibe I'm getting. You're projecting. <laughs> Wherever. All right, we'll put in a heart at least. Well, love's hard work, babe. Hate to break it to you. Really? Love is painful. What do you got here? That's solid. This little stick? Yeah. I'm so out of breath. You just climbed one little branch. Well, we've been walking and climbing. <laughs> I gotta get you up here. Ooh, yeah. What?